Hi everyone, welcome to Kavita's Sugar and Spice. Today we are going to make oats chapatis. These days a lot of people have oats for dinner. If you are tired and bored with the same recipe, here we have a different dish with oats. Oats chapati. Let's see how we make it. So in order to make oats chapati, we have one and a half cups of oats and half cup of wheat flour. We need to grind this oats into a fine powder using a mixing. Once it's ground, let's sift it with the colander to get a smooth powder. We are not using those coarse particles. Now we need to boil one cup of water. So once the water is boiled, we add salt to it and one teaspoon of olive oil. Oil is totally optional. Now we are going to add half of the oats powder little by little and we mix it. We mix it into a smooth paste and then we add rest of the oats. Right now I'm using a spoon here to mix it because the water is really really hot. Once it becomes a nice paste we cover that and let it rest for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, I added the half cup of wheat flour to it and now let's knead it into a smooth dough. As oats is sticky in nature, you can add some oil to your hands while kneading. Let it rest for another 10 minutes. Please try this recipe. I would love to know your feedback. Make small lemon sized balls and roll it flat using oats powder or wheat powder. If you are using oats powder, it should be really fine. Do not use too much pressure while rolling. Also, do not flip it while rolling like a normal chapati. It is too soft and delicate, it might tear or crack. Now you can gently take the chapati and cook it on a cast iron pan. Cook it until both sides are lightly browned. See how it puffs up? Since we used hot water for oats, it's already cooked. So you don't have to cook it for a long time. Here our oats chapati is ready. It's a very soft and healthy chapati. Maybe it's even softer than our regular chapati. Please try it. I'm sure you will love it. If you like this recipe, click the thumbs up button and remember to subscribe for more recipes. And click the bell icon for notification when I post new recipes. Thank you for your precious time watching my videos.